Today I'm going to show you how to create flyers like one of these two here using Adobe Spark Post. So if you want to learn how, stick around I'll show you. Hey everybody, what's going on? Claudio here and welcome to my channel where I share tips, tools and tricks to help you tell your story. Today I'm going to walk you through how to create flyers like these here using Adobe Spark Post. Now, flyers are a great way to promote an event, share an idea. You can print these out and you can also share them online. I'm going to be using my computer to do this, but you can also create these on your iPhone or Android as well as on the iPad. So without any further ado, let's go ahead and jump into the computer. So I'm going to start by clicking on the blue plus sign to start a project. And right there, I have the option to choose flyer. It is 11 by 17, but you could always change that uh, to any size you want. Uh, first thing I'll do is click on add and look for a photo. I'm going to find a free photo. I've already typed in yoga here and I'm going to scroll through to look for one uh, with the pose that I want and pretty much any one will work, but I'm going to look for one that has not too much of a distraction in the background. So I'm going to show you a tool in Adobe Spark Post where you can remove the background. I'm going to be using this one here. I'm going to choose to move this freely. So let's resize that, make it a little bit bigger. And what I'm going to do here now is let's bring it back in. Choose this tool here, remove background. Now it's in beta. If you want to learn more about this, I have a video. You can check it out up here. There we go. Uh, it's got the background removed and I'm going to enlarge it and probably put it here. Now I'm going to flip this around so it's facing the opposite direction. And let's kind of move it about right there. And now the next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to split the background here and let's go to layout. We're going to do two sections here and maybe bring that split kind of down by her leg there. And I'm going to use a white background on the top and here at the bottom, you, as you can tell, you have some suggested colors. I'm going to go with that one there and let's go ahead and add some text now so we're going to click on add and choose the add your text option i'm going to put this in big letters first yoga let's do yoga class and we're going to take this large and move it up here now i don't like that box in the background or that shape so i'm going to go to shape over here and Remove the shape and let's do a little bit of manipulation of the text. Let's uh, bring the size, the line spacing size down. I'm going to align this so it's all the same uh, alignment right and left and maybe change the font. So let's go with, let's see, choose something a little bit thicker. Let's try that there. Now. Let's do yeah. find the right one. Yoga class. Let's go with that one there. Uh, let's do yoga class there. Maybe just adjust her a little bit here. Bring, make her a little bit larger. And let's make the yoga class resize it a bit there. And here's where I may adjust the size of the uh, flyer, but I'm just going to leave it the way it is. So we got yoga class and let's add some more text here. Let's do kind of like some of the information for the class and the text here. And let's say, um, uh, join now for, I, I, I don't honestly know how much yoga costs. So if you're a yoga, um, enthusiast there, um, you will need to forgive me. I'll just say nine twenty nine a month. Um, again, I don't know if that's the right amount. You all will forgive me for that. And we're going to move this here, maybe about right there. And I'm going to change the font, make this a little bit um, 
different than what we have up there. Let's change the color. Let's go with the um, suggested colors here. Let's see. Maybe let's go with. There we go. It looks like it doesn't want to pick the color. So I'm going to show you a little trick here. We're going to use the eyedropper. There we go. So now it's the same color as that text up there. Join now. And let's do some more adjusting line spacing. Let's bring that down. And then you can letter space this as well. Join now. 29 a month. And then you have your um, information here. Let's let's align these left that's too much there we go close enough there i may just bring her a little bit to there we go and then we're going to do all those uh details you know that uh all the uh, fine print so i'm going to use some um filler text here lorem ipsum there we go uh just some of that other information that you may need to share in a flyer. Again, it's just filler text here. And then one last piece of text at the bottom. And this is kind of like location. Uh, let's go ahead and adjust that down here. Bring the letter spacing in and there we go. And just kind of adjust it. Boom. So there we go. A quick, yoga class flyer put together here in adobe spark post so let's go ahead and let's name this yoga flyer up here on the upper left corner if you didn't know you can do that you can name your projects there all right there we go so we have this one and if i want to now i can download this as a pdf so if i want to print this out you can choose pdf and if you want to share online you can do png or jpeg so that's the first flyer so now let's do another flyer let's go ahead and click on that button again and this time i'm going to choose a uh, custom size graphic here and let's go with print i'm going to do a print and maybe this time go five by seven card so let's go next and i'm going to do a kind of like a i would say a coffee shop announcement so um, like a meet and greet type thing and let's go ahead and change the background. We're going to go all black on the background here. And this time I'm going to be using some icons for this flyer. So let's type in coffee. So if you're watching this in the morning, you need some coffee. So this is a, a hint here for, for you. So find the right icon here. Mm, let's see here. Uh, may go with that one there yeah let's do that uh well maybe not with the flame let's try something without a flame i don't i don't like that flame mm, let's see I'm trying to get one there we go we'll use that one i wanted to get one kind of that has that uh top down look and let's change the color to white we're going to kind of center that up there we go got those guidelines and uh i'm gonna i'm going to actually put a border around this let's go to icon and let's see if we type in border yeah so we got some stuff here just find the right one um let's see try that one there that looks okay we maybe change it not liking it too much. Um, actually, let's do this. Let's go rectangle. You got to hear my thinking here, changing my mind as I'm working on this, which is just fine. Let's go with that there. Hmm. Let's go simple line. That's a little too thick. Let's see. Let's see how this looks. Yep. Uh, trying to find just that right one so bear with me for a second rectangle let's see here let's see how that one looks okay perfect we're going to yes 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 there we go grab that and get there change the color to white 
and I may just bring down the opacity a bit. Oops. Just a little bit. And I may not end up using this. I'm, I'm kind of not feeling it now. Let's just delete it all together. That's fine. All right, let's do some, let's add some text here. So we're going to add text. Now, really cool idea. You could add some of these uh, kind of formatted text. So if you want kind of a curved text, but I'm going to, I'm going to go with kind of uh, regular, um, regular text here. So let's do, uh, uh, meet and greet coffee time and let's add that there. I can't see it because there we go. Let's remove that shape in the background and let's go with white because we're going to do like just a really nice contrast look here and let's go back to that and let's time. I, I, I I like the um, align kind of com capitalize and fit. I just, I'm a fan of that. I'm not a fan of that font though. So let's go through and change that. Uh, let's see here. Let's do, yeah, that kind of looks cool. There we go, meet and greet, coffee time. And Say here. Maybe move this down a bit. Make this a little bit bigger. Meet and greet. And there we go. I'm going to add some information text at the top. Again, I'm going to use filler text right now. Just because this is basically designing it. Let's get smaller. We're going to move that up here. And let's see, maybe change that a little bit. Nope. Let's go with for two. Right there we go. And for this one, I'm actually going to stick with center, so we get the um, we get capitals and lowercase. Put that up there at the top. Center that. It's not wanting to cooperate, so I'm going to select the whole thing and center it. Nope. Oh, wrong one. That's not what I wanted to do. Align. There we go. Align. And then let's give some uh, information where it's taking place. So we're going to add some more text. Actually, just make this easier. I'm going to click on that. Duplicate it. Bring this down. And let's enter all that information, like what time it takes place. Adjust the line spacing, letter spacing, leave that. Let's see, let's. That's some more. About there, and we should be right about done. There we go. We're gonna move that down there. Boom, there we got it. Meet and greet, coffee time. Um, taking place at Lorem Ipsum Dolor Sit, you know, reading some Latin there. So there we go. Uh, a flyer just using a uh, text, a group of text and an icon and just simple contrast color, black and white. And now again, go over to download. You can save it as a PNG, JPEG and share online or download as PDF to print. And that my friends is how you create flyers using Adobe Spark Post. If you have any comments or questions, please do add it in the comments section below. If you have a flyer you want to share with me, go ahead and link it in there as well. Don't forget, click that like button, subscribe to the channel, share it with others, and then click on the bell to be notified for future videos just like this one. Thank you again for watching, and as always, be good to one another. Peace. I'm out.